my dear friends in Christ Jesus I welcome every one of you to the second day of the novena of the miraculous mother I wish and pray that through the intercession of mother Mary the Lord may continue to shower his blessings upon us today we are going to reflect about the life of Saint John Gabriel Perubairo and his devotion to the miraculous mother Saint John Gabriel Perubairo the first saint who took the medal to china november 27 1830 was not the first time mother of our lord had appeared to saint catherine labore a daughter of charity of saint vincent de paul the humble saint who saw the blessed mother standing on a globe while crushing a serpent with her feet our lady's hands were open and brilliant rays of light streamed from jeweled rings on them an oval soon formed around blessed mother and the gold inscription read o mary conceived without sin pray for us who have recourse to you st john gabriel perbaire was a vincentian martyr in wuhan china he was a contemporary saint of st catherine and might be the first person who carried the miraculous medal to china 5 years after the apparition in december of 1835 father perboyre along with several missionaries set sail from macao in a junk since the chinese law forbade the entry of christian missionaries the christian captain and crew disguised themselves as merchants and smuggled john gabriel onto the mainland of china by the end of 1837 the people throughout the world had learned about the miraculous medal and around that time a woman in china received a miracle she was given the medal by saint john gabriel perboire a holy priest who was on a mission in Honan the saint who was later imprisoned tortured for about a year and martyred in 1840 at the age of 38 because of his christian faith he met a woman by the help of other living christians in Honan they told the holy priest that this woman desperately wanted him to hear her confession even though she had been mentally disturbed for 8 months it was impossible for her to make a good confession but the holy priest john gabriel perboire compassionately agreed to hear her although she she didn't know what it was the saint gave her the miraculous medal after the confession so that she could be under the protection of blessed mother only four or five days later she was amazed the healing that had taken place her mental suffering and the anguish had been replaced by peace joy and happiness in his letters to his province Saint Perboire has written many miracles happened in his mission area of China by the miraculous medal. Therefore my dear friends we see Saint John Gabriel Perboire was an ambassador in proclaiming the devotion of this medal to the whole nation of China. O Mary conceived without sin pray for us who have recourse to you.